welcome, welcome to Messy Bun Sister, Sister Podcast. <laughs> I'm Alyssa. And I'm Lauren. This is episode 20. 20. Which is how many times David just tried to get off the couch <laughs> right now. Y'all, this is a real comfortable couch. <laughs> but he had the baby and he was like, well, one, one, two. <laughs> Usually it's the double pump will do on normal couches, but that was like seven times. Oh my God. That was so funny. <laughs> That's why you're laughing. I'm also asleep. What? I'm, I'm asleep right now. I am too. I was trying like, before we started, I was closed my eyes and I was like, I'm going to take like a two minute nap before we start. Well, a power nap. Oh, I got up at six 30 this morning, which is, I got up at six 30 every morning. <laughs> Okay. Also, we're doing this in the daytime, which we never really do. That's true. So I wonder if the lighting looks different. Probably looks better. You think so? I think so. I also, tell us what you guys think. Like, we were thinking about moving our podcast again. <laughs> the back, I mean, if you watch on YouTube, if you just listen, it doesn't matter. Um, but a you, podcast is just to listen. So we only do the videos. For why? For viewing <laughs> pleasures of our f- friends because <laughs> our know. friends want to see our faces i guess they do yeah maybe we'll just switch it to podcast only i don't know it's up to you does that make you sad kind of why because i think a lot of people like to watch on youtube like mom and dad yeah a lot of people <laughs> they really like it i guess so speaking of that uh, mom and dad did our review of the week yeah so if you guys want to do review of the week other than (laughs) our parents (laughs) which we love getting their comments it's actually really funny um so this was really weird okay so when we talked about our enneagrams last week we went through like our numbers and um letters or whatever for yeah myers-briggs and stuff um so what's crazy is okay so i'm a seven Mm -hmm. in the enneagram right And for whatever reason, like growing up, and I just realized this the other day, like growing up, I was always number seven. Oh, yeah. uh, In like sports and stuff. Well, you didn't realize it. Dad did. Yeah. So he commented, this is dad's review of the week, is at Lauren. You were number seven in softball and volleyball in high school. You are seven. You are seven. That blew my mind. Because literally... Maybe you claimed it over your life. Maybe you, you know what? Okay. I'm a big believer of like saying things over and over and over again to something. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Like I literally wore the number seven and now I you became are seven. seven. I'm going to try that with my kids. What's the best number though? There's not like a great number. Just, but just say positive things to them. What number do I want them to be? And I'm going to only put it in that number. No. <gasps> that makes you wonder what number Alec is, our brother. Enneagram? What if he's a four? I will freak out because Alec's like whole existence. Existence. Okay. Alec's whole like. Um, Speaking of Alec. Yeah. Well, it, I we did ask him last minute, but. What happened, Alyssa? No, I'm a, I'm a nine. <laughs> <laughs> I'm harmonious. What happened? I'm harmonious. I don't want to. But what happened? I just invited him to come and be on our 20th podcast as our special guest. And he said he was too tired. He was too tired to be on our 20th. I understand, Alec. (laughs) It's okay. To be on our 20th podcast. On January 20th. Oh, so you missed out. It could have been a special day. I think it's still special, but I do miss. I do. We will interview him soon. I guess. (laughs) <laughs> yeah, we will. Probably next month, actually. Yeah. I have it on the thing. Anyway. So be on the lookout, people. For Alec. Okay, so he legit bought a man bun on from Amazon. Yes. <laughs> oh, that's going to be funny. But he bought it when we first started the podcast, like a couple months ago. So yeah, he's, he's been, been like waiting. waiting. And the time we invite him, he says well, no. I, I literally invited him this morning to come record. So what? Alec, you always have to be prepared to be on the podcast. You never <laughs> At know. At any point, we can just ask I know. random people so everybody be prepared. <laughs> you could be on the podcast next. Be prepared. Where's that from? Wasn't it a hymn? No. <laughs> a hymn? 
Oh, no, no, no. Beep. No, is it's it from a Christmas? It's from a Christmas pageant. Yeah. Be prepared about what? <sighs> Jesus. <laughs> Second coming. I'm so sleepy. I know. Like, I'm trying really hard to, like... Open your eat. eyes. <laughs> okay, I legit had three full cups of coffee. <gasps> My coffee is over there. Go get it. I thought we weren't allowed to have coffee on the couch. Oh, you're right. Yeah, I can't have coffee on the couch. So today we thought we'd do something fun. Um, and just, like, in the spirit of being chill and relaxed and sleepy, we're just going to, like, ask each other... Each other asking each other. We're, oh yeah, yeah. It is an asking question. Yeah, we're gonna ask each other the whole time. Would you rather to get uh? What time is it? Four forty-four. <laughs> <Okay. gasps> oh my god! <laughs> you guys, every time, every time I look at the time, it's four forty-four. Me too. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That was crazy. <laughs> okay, it like literally I used to see 444 Everywhere, every day, yeah. every day yeah. and, and everything. It was always 444. <laughs> and Octo- Oct- um, Octavia Spencer posted about it the other day. But there's she sees 444 too. She sees 444 too. It's cuz we're getting reset. Yeah. Okay, so tell us what In that matrix. means. In the matrix. I don't know. In the matrix we're getting reset. That's so, all I know. Is it true? So that means that, like, so, like, we're getting updated in the Matrix. Oh, yeah. So, like, we're due for an update, I guess. Okay. I'm new. I'm new in Christ. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> I can't. Okay. That's just, and in a couple of weeks, we're going to talk about conspiracy theories, too. Yes. I cannot wait to, like, talk about it. Lauren's good at that. I'm I want to go. About, I want to, so I want to talk about conspiracy theories. I want to talk about some, like true crime stuff i want to talk about scientology i want to talk about uh just like the clinton stuff like i want to talk about everything okay okay <laughs> no i know you're excited i'm super <laughs> excited okay but for now we're gonna do would you rather so i'm gonna go through one Keep them clean these are clean okay so i'm gonna go through some um and you have to tell me why too okay okay so number one would you rather lose all of your money and valuables or all the pictures you've ever taken? Money and valuables. So you want to keep pictures. Why? Because I have terrible memory. So pictures are like so important to me. That's good. Okay. Would you rather be able to see 10 minutes into your own future or 10 minutes into the future of anyone but yourself? That's a good uh, one. Wait, repeat the question. I have to process this. Would you rather be able to see 10 minutes into your own future Uh or 10 minutes into the future of anyone but yourself? I'd want to see in my future. Yeah. Just because I'm selfish. And like, why would I care about other people's futures? What if you could see into Trent's future, but you could still see yourself in his future? Well, but it's only 10 minutes. So like at 454. (laughs) You could see yourself for the first time in your entire life. I would look the same and probably be wearing the same clothes and walking around. And I know, but I'd li- probably be laying down watching it. TV. You, you and your entire life will never see what you really look like. Ever. Well, what? No, I'm saying I want to see my future. I know. But what I'm saying is I would want to see like I would want to see into David's future because I'd want to see what it looks like to look out of David's eyeballs and on me why that's what a mirror is for mirrors that's what i'm saying is a mirror is not an actual like representation it's a reflection 3d it's just a reflection so you never really see what you really look like so i don't care okay i care all right i think it's cool i think that <laughs> so, would be so, so cool. you would want to see in david's future yeah hmm. okay here's a question would you rather be famous when you are alive and forgotten Wait, <laughs> would you rather be famous when you are alive and forgotten when you die or unknown when you are? <laughs> Can you, I'm so confused. The, I'm like, let me, okay, I'm going to read this word for word. <laughs> would you rather be famous when you are alive and forgotten when you die or unknown when you are alive and famous after you die? 
Okay, that one's on. I'm so <laughs> confused. I'm going to try to skip. Okay. <laughs> I'm so confused. Okay, go. Would you rather go to jail for four years with something for something you didn't do or get away with something horrible you did but always live with in fear for being caught? Hmm. <coughs> So would you rather go to jail for being innocent or get away with something but live with fear about being caught? I think get away with something with fear. Yeah, I think so too. Because, yeah. Why would you want to... But define horrible. Yeah. You know? I'm thinking like steal some money. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) Like that's kind of... I mean, it's horrible. Not like murder. Okay. (laughs) I was not even thinking that that horrible. Yeah. Because I wouldn't want to be in jail for something I didn't do. Right. And be pissed the whole time. Yeah. And the lawyers suck. You have to. It's stupid. Like, but also, watch Orange is the New Black. Yeah. But then I think what's more, what's morally the right thing to do? Now I'm conflicted. <laughs> <laughs> <That's> <laughs> I don't know. Whatever the good Christian answer is, that's what I want to do. <laughs> I would think I would steal money and live with fear of being caught. Yeah. Yeah. Because I want to go to jail. Yeah. I don't want to go to jail. Because this doesn't say you're going to get caught. That's just true. live in fear. Cool. All right. Now you ask me. Okay. Would you rather accidentally be responsible? No, no, no. <laughs> would you? Ra- would you? Would you rather sh- your shirts be always two sizes too big or one size too small? Two sizes too big. Really? Yeah. <laughs> okay. I think two sizes too big too because that's okay. the kind of shirts I wear anyway. So, yes, <laughs> me too. And see, here's the thing: if my shirts were small, my Boobs would be huge. Okay. That's all I'm saying. Like, what's the point? Okay. Next question. Okay. Hang on. Okay. Go. Okay. Would you rather live in the wilderness far from civilization or live on the streets of a city as a homeless person? Far from civilization in the wilderness. Like all day, every day. And eat locusts? Yeah. Why would you? Why would I want to be a homeless person in the streets? You're technically homeless in the wilderness. Yeah, but you. I don't know. It's just different. It seems you have to like kill to live. Where if you're a homeless person, people give you food. I know, but I don't know. I don't want to be a homeless person. But you'd be homeless either way. Okay, let me re-ask this question. Would you rather be homeless living in the wilderness far from civilization or live in the streets of a city as a homeless person? Yeah, I guess it would be easier to get stuff as a homeless person on the streets. Okay. Okay, so we legit met. Okay, so my best friend moved across the street Uh and her dog has not met Lucy. And so we decided to have them meet in their dog park. Uh And while we were there, there was a homeless, like a young homeless person his name was flo he flo flo i don't that's not his real name honestly right. but he called himself a traveler he like, was like i'm like traveler 4139 <laughs> like a time traveler <laughs> yeah <laughs> no i don't know but anyway he was <laughs> like he was he says i go from portland to portland hollywood to hollywood so there's a portland maine yeah. portland Oregon, Hollywood, uh, California, Hollywood, Florida. Right. So he like jumps on train. He like hit. He like gets on freight trains. Like classic, like nomad. Yeah, he said, "I have the nomad gene." Nomadic gene. And he was like a young dude, like super, how young? Probably twenty three, I would say. Wow. But he had like a long beard. He had no shoes. Um, but he was like, yeah. Um. When I got here, there was somebody who used to be an ex-traveler that houses a lot of the travelers. I know. And I was like, that's crazy. He's like, yeah, around here. We ended up, or Lauren <clears throat> went to the apartment and like got him food and stuff. But it was Wouldn't like. Wouldn't it be funny if people don't know that your best friend's name is Lauren and then you're like talking about yourself in third person. <laughs> Lauren went to get <laughs> food for this man. But he was like, he, he was like. Thank you for your generosity, but I don't have that much stuff. And she's like, oh, no, everything I give you is going to be small. Yeah. And he was like, okay, cool. And he had a dog. His name was Odie. Odie. I know. It was really crazy. Like, he was telling us some a bunch of, like, crazy stories. But, I mean, he gets food. So, to answer your story, I'd be a homeless person. Right? So okay. I'd be a homeless person in the city. Because it'd be easier to get food. Yeah. Okay. Next question. 
Would you rather the general public think you are a horrible person, but your family be very proud of you? Or your family think you are a very horrible person, but the general public be very proud of you? Whoa. Right? Okay, reread it. Would you rather the general public think you are a horrible person, but your family be very proud of you? Or your family think you are a horrible person, but the general public be very proud of you? Um... I feel like I would want my family to be proud of you. And like, I don't care about the general public. Yeah. That's what I would say too. I thought about it for a sec. Like my family can always like love me and stuff. Hi Lucy. But they're, they don't. Yeah. They do love you. They just aren't proud of you. No, they think you're a horrible person. Oh no. Yeah. I'd rather have my family. Yeah. Be very proud of you. <clears throat> yeah. When would that ever be like a situation though? <laughs> If you did the horrible thing and was scared to get caught. Oh, okay. Next okay. question. I'm trying to find a, a really good one. Why? Just give me a, give me a normal one. Fine. Would you rather be alone for the rest of your life or be surrounded by annoying people? I read that one and I didn't want to answer it. <laughs> <laughs> See? That's one I wanted to skip, but you're like, why read it? No, there was another one on top that I wanted to answer. (laughs) (laughs) No, yeah, now you have to answer this one. Okay, live alone or be surrounded by annoying people. Honestly, it takes a lot to annoy me. And honestly, I'm already surrounded by no annoying people. (laughs) (laughs) How rude. (laughs) I think I'd be surrounded by annoying people. Me too. Really? I already am. I don't want to be alone. I know. Without Trent or Lucy. Yeah, but what if they become annoying? Lucy's already annoying. <laughs> okay, fine. The one above it. This is a stupid question. Okay, fine. Next. Skip. Let me ask you. You just ask me. Okay. Uh, Would you? <laughs> this is a good one for you. Would you rather never use social media sites slash apps again or never watch another movie or TV show? Right? That one's a hard one for you. Okay, so here's the thing. Facebook has started to add, like, TV shows. Okay, that's not what it's saying, though. You can't, like... But it's a social media app. (sighs) That's true, but... What uh, is considered social media? Okay, well, then you answer. You're being (coughs) really difficult. Surrounded by annoying people. (laughs) I'm ready to go to sleep. Oh, you are such a brat. <laughs> Comment below if you think this is a brat. Don't do that. Well. Okay, answer the question. I know, what would you do? Probably delete social media. No, that was actually, it's really been hard. Yeah. No, I'd probably just never watch a movie or TV show again. Because I don't really watch movies anyways. Yeah. And the TV shows I watch are dumb. What do you watch? You watch like Fixer Upper? No. I just watch stuff like to have on the TV. It's background music. <laughs> background noise, you mean? Yeah. Honestly, I watch TV. The only stuff I really watch on TV is like interesting to me. So I watch okay, the well, Scientology pick one. thing. I'm talking. <laughs> That's what a podcast is. It's okay, just my tell question me. and answer. Tell me. After 20 episodes, you'd think you'd know. Huh? After 20 episodes, you think you would know... uh, Oh, of our podcast. Yeah. Okay, well, what were you saying? (laughs) I don't want to tell you now. (laughs) (laughs) Okay, ready? Yeah. Um, Ooh, would you rather be the first person to explore a planet or be the inventor of a drug that cures a deadly disease? Inventor of a drug that cures a deadly disease. I'd rather be the first person on a planet. Really? Why? Because it's a whole new planet. A whole new planet. <laughs> and like it would be cool to like travel in space. Yeah. To find the planet. Yeah. To be like in. T- uh, what's it Interstellar. called? Interstellar. Interstellar. <laughs> I was like Interception. <laughs> Interception. Those are both <coughs> really trippy movies. You know, Interception, wait, (laughs) Inception is on Netflix, I think. I don't know. I really want to see Interstellar, though, again. I, okay, the first time I saw Interstellar was, like, after everyone had watched it, and I watched it, I I don't remember what, what, where I watched it, but I thought about it literally every day for two weeks. Yeah. I was like, this movie is the trippiest movie. It is. 
I like was obsessed with it. Yeah. Anyway, go ahead. Next question. Okay. Would you rather be completely invisible for one day? (laughs) And you got mad at me for saying that I was tired and wanting to take a nap. (laughs) Really? (laughs) Okay. Would Mm -hmm. you rather be completely invisible for one day or be able to fly for one day? That's you really can hard. Fly. Okay, so I'm thinking like I would like to be invisible because I'd like to sneak up on people and see what they're saying. You know I would I mean? like to not know what anyone else is saying. Why? I'd like to fly. Because then you can use it against them. No. Yeah. No, I don't want to know what anybody else is saying about me. I don't care. I mean, I care, but I don't want to know. I didn't necessarily mean about me, Alyssa. You're oh. conceited. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to see what people are saying. <laughs> what if they're talking bad about you? Then I can use it against them. No. Like I just said. <laughs> but then being be- being able to just like jump and fly yes. would be also really cool because yes. you can get to the people faster. <laughs> you want both. <laughs> I want to do both. It's, would you rather? I think I would fly. <laughs> <laughs> So now you changed your answer. <laughs> no, I didn't. I didn't give you an answer. I was you going said through first. Both. Invisible. I said the reason why I want to be oh. invisible versus. Okay. And then the reason why I would want to fly. I like to fly. Okay. Because. I'd like to fly too. Then you can go really fast. I just. We should get to tr- Tiff's treats after this. <laughs> <laughs> Not a sponsor. But <laughs> I know, I just think. What? How you're sleepy? Okay. Let's, let's find one good one. And then we'll be done. Okay. Ooh, okay, let's see. Okay, Alyssa, are you ready? I'm ready. Would you rather live without the internet or live without AC and heating? Depends on where I'm living. Now, here. Without AC and heating. Alyssa. I know. Why? But also not having the internet sex too. Yeah, but without, think about it. Like it's cold today outside, yes, uh-huh. but then you bundle up. It never gets extremely cold or extremely hot in San. I mean, it gets hot, but it then you just put really a fan on. Hot. I don't know. Just I put a fan on. I think you'd eat AC. No, I think I'd be fine. That's a really hard question. All right, my turn. Oh, so I have to find a really good one. Um, I was telling Alyssa earlier, it's crazy because I went to dinner with my cousin who has a little six-year-old kid, Aron, shout out. Hi, Aron. <laughs> <laughs> but um, Anna Marisa, hello. Um, but he, we were at a restaurant and he goes, mom, he has a little, he has a little iPad and he was playing. He's like, mom, Ooh, there's no Wi-Fi. And she was like, okay. And he goes, but how? <laughs> <laughs> and it was just so funny because he was like, he didn't understand that not everywhere he goes has the internet, yeah. you know? And we were like, that's so funny because when we were growing up, like we, we didn't, have, didn't the have the internet. And now we're like, back in my day when we didn't have the internet. You well, know? we had the internet, but. No. We didn't, didn't have Wi-Fi. Right. I got, yeah, we had to like dial, dial up. up and everything. and But like. Yeah, Wi-Fi wasn't a thing until, I don't even know. But what I'm saying, uh, we were like having a conversation about like that sort of like drastic change is like when people went from candles only to like electricity. Right. You know what I mean? So like kids like Aron are going to grow up like with the internet as like this thing that's just there. You know right. what I mean? Like it's just, you, you don't just even. Switch. It's just on. Yeah, you don't have to even think about the time before the internet, you know, just like we don't have to think about time before electricity. Weird. You know what I mean? Like that's just how it is in our life. So weird. Except obviously when there's like power outages, we have to like candles. (laughs) But I mean like, you know what I mean? Like when there's power outages, the kids don't have to camp on the internet. But it's like, that's crazy how we're living in the time when, um, like similar to like a hundred years ago when they went from candles to electricity from like and no internet to internet. It was crazy. That's so, that's mind blowing to think like Liam's going to live in a world that he'll always know like 
technology and yeah. advanced, so advanced technology. Anyways, last question. Okay, make you good. I think it's good. Would you rather be transported permanently 500 years into the future Ooh. or 500 years into the past? Future. Why? Because think about how women were 500 oh, years ago. yeah. And tampons are amazing. Okay. <laughs> and I'm sure they have that in the future. You know what I mean? Like, or some other form of it. But who, I mean, who knows how women are going to be treated five years in the future? What if, what if 500 years in the future? <laughs> <laughs> it's like Handmaid's Tale. Well, that'll suck. But you just rather risk like the unknown than the known. Okay, so 500 years ago was like the 1500s, right? Yeah. No. <laughs> we just I'm talking just about saying. electricity versus electricity. They had no electricity. They pooped outside. But what outside. I'm saying is like, what if it's like that? What if it's like Handmaid's Tale or like Travelers, like that show Travelers yeah. where the guy, where in the future, nobody has anything because it's like freaking Ice Age. I think I'd risk it. Okay. Good to know. Yeah. I don't know what I would do, actually. I'd probably go in the future, too. Yeah. Because you have a better chance. You know what I mean? Like, you know for sure that how women crap. were treated back then. Yeah. You don't know. What, what if, if it's it worse? What if it's worse? <laughs> I don't know. Anyways, so... Um, I'm sinking into the couch. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, be sure to... Like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And honestly, <laughs> I'm sunken in. <laughs> um, also to our iTunes, subscribe to our iTunes. Don't forget. Um, and I'm, I'm probably not off screen. And also we have a Patreon account. <gasps> that was Lucy. No, it was my phone. <laughs> oh, we have a Patreon account. <laughs> Lucy. Okay. Um, where you can go and um, contribute to our um, podcast. podcast and you can be uh, a <laughs> Stop <special> saying uh. <laughs> you talk then. <laughs> Alrighty. <laughs> Okie dokie. <laughs>